there's just no there's place, just to, no eat place to eat around here. You can't find any place here to eat. There isn't places to eat. Probably got about McDonald's. I mean, there's not really much about unless you go for like um, all the main big McDonald's and Burger Kings and stuff like that. I come here to shop, but it would be better if there was like a lot of more food places where to eat. Yeah. Disappointing on Oxford Street, there's nothing to we, we can eat. Yeah. Visiting one of the most famous streets in London and guess what, there's nowhere to eat. The new generation, they need something that they can come together and feel not overpriced, fair and not constantly commercialised by all the other big brands. Things missing from Oxford Street are foods, uh, places where we can just kind of pull up, grab something to eat. There's no place to go, so I need to always go out of this uh, beautiful street. So. More diversified food and different kind of food that can bring people together. Uh, so it'd be good to have something local to here uh, where I work five days a week. What I could really do with it is something like you get in Borough Market or in Camden. I would like to have more different uh, foods. Loads of street food in one place. I think it'd be really good because like, it will help the tourism as well. It's amazing being here and uh, we really like the street food and uh, the ambiance is amazing and uh, it's quite a pity we don't have this in uh, central London but it would be amazing to have things like this in central London because uh, it's just a good vibe, uh, everybody's happy, everybody's eating. Uh. I feel like if there was something like this around Oxford Street, something a little bit more central, the other attractions, I feel like we could quite benefit from this, you know? Food, the vibe. When you put food and people together with money, it's a win-win, isn't it? I love this place. It's just so different than what we can find in the centre of London. And I think it's very authentic. It's like you just come to life. You do. You come in and you experience all the culture. But uh, Camden Market, as you can see, is really busy. So much choice. Loads of different cultures and foods. And it's a shame that you don't have this in central London. It's street food and it's really delicious and it's a shame that it isn't in central London. Hi, I'm Chris Harding from Tonic Associates, an award-winning design practice based in central London. We were recently appointed to develop a luxury street food inspired venue, taking inspiration from the likes of the Time Out building in uh, Lisbon and the Chelsea Market development in New York. To be based in the West End of London, the only major retail hub in Europe that does not have its own indoor street food offer. We've worked very hard to create a fresh, naturally inspired vibe with smart modern extraction systems that cope with the historic architecture of London. That's well, that sounds good. That would sound wonderful. Just let me know when it's opening. I'll be there.